But how do we handle a friend who constantly lies? Let's bring it closer to home now. How do you handle a friend or a family member or coworker that you're close to who constantly lies? Right? And they love the drama. How do you handle somebody like that? Right? It's not easy. Okay? Because there's a relationship there. But if you suspect that a friend is lying on uh, to you, right, it can be very difficult. And, and oftentimes it's very uncomfortable to confront them about it. But it's important to address the situation in a way that is, you know, respectful and preserves the integrity of your friendship. Because that's what's at stake at that point. Right. That friendship um, may fall to the left or to the right. Um, but the question then becomes, are you going to be able to rebuild it or reestablish it to the place where you both once were? And that's really what's at risk when that happens. So here are some steps for handling, you know, that friend who tends to lie that you suspect is lying. If you suspect that a friend is lying to you, it's important to confront them about it in a direct and non-accusatory way. Right. This can involve stating your concerns and asking them if they have been truthful with you. Just be straight up with it. But once you've confronted your friend about their behavior, it's important to listen to their explanation and consider their perspective. Were they going through something? Did they feel like they couldn't trust you and that's why they started lying? Did you do something to, you know, uh, initiate them in this behavior? Um, or did someone else outside of your relationship, you know, plant a seed, a rumor that, you know, caused them to start going down this path of not trusting you and, and lying to you? OK, um, they may have a valid reason for why they lied and understanding their point of view can help to resolve that situation. So this is where critical thinking comes in. You have to gather as much information as possible and apply it to your situation, your scenario, and then see where you can get the best results. Right. If you're not satisfied with your friend's explanation or if their behavior is unacceptable to you, it's important to express your concerns, right? And while you're expressing those concerns, also make sure you outline the boundaries that are, you know, violated and be clear about them, okay? This can involve telling them how, you know, their behavior has affected you and setting limits on what you are willing to accept moving forward. If it's impacting you to a great degree, why let it continue? Set your boundaries. Right? This is the other problem. A lot of us don't have boundaries. We just have assumptions and expectations that are so unrealistic that when someone acts within those, we're like, whoa, this person's acting out of character. No, they're not. They're just being human. You didn't set any boundaries. You, didn't, you just had your own expectations of how you would have conducted yourself in those scenarios. But it doesn't mean that they're, you know, um, adopted the same mindset. So, <clears throat> if your friend's behavior has caused you some pain or betrayal, it's important to take some time, right, to process your feelings and decide on a course of action. Again, if you notice, this comes back to you and what are you going to do about it? What are you willing to do about it? And at what cost? Because there's going to be a price to be paid. Okay? Now, this may involve, you know, seeking support from others, Right, such as maybe a therapist or close family members and considering whether you want to continue the friendship or not. That's the biggest decision that you have to make. Is this a worthy friend? Is this somebody that I still consider a friend? It's important to recognize that handling a lying friend involves confronting them about their behavior, listening and you know to their explanation and perspective. Expressing your concerns is also critical, setting your boundaries and taking some time to process your feelings and decide on a course of action.